All right, so I'm going to show you how you can record yourself delivering a presentation. This is available to you on WebEx, or I can show it to you on Zoom. Uh, right now, I think what I'm going to do is record using WebEx. So I'm in WebEx right now recording, and I'm going to show you myself working through Zoom. So it uh, might be a little convoluted, and then I'll do it the other way. I'll record myself in Zoom working through WebEx. So crazy, huh? All right, so uh, this is myself. I just started a meeting. I'm in my own room, and I'm meeting with myself. <laughs> so uh, there's no audience, but it will show my image uh, kind of overlaid with the content that I'm going to share. Uh, I think that's, if I maybe stop my video, I think I can turn that off. So it's sort of up to you if you want to be part of the presentation as a friendly face on the side of the slides you're presenting, uh, or you could just be the audio behind the scenes. I guess one piece of advice before you get started, I did this once already and I forgot to turn on my microphone. So <laughs> uh, make sure that's enabled before you start. Uh, so I'm gonna go down and do the share option here. Uh, what did I say I was gonna do? I'm gonna share my screen and then I'm gonna skip over to Zoom so you can see that uh, happening. It's a little hard for me to show you my self sharing the stuff I'm recording. Uh, unless I use the two programs like this. So now I'm in Zoom. I'm going to set up a meeting with his, with just me again. So I set up a meeting. It's me. And uh, I can do the same thing. I can record. So uh, I'm recording this to the cloud. Or Sorry, I'm recording it locally, and it's going to uh, make the file available to me once I'm done recording. So again, if you want to start with an image of yourself, a little video introduction, it's kind of nice to put a friendly face on this. Uh, you don't have to do that. And then I'm going to go and do the share screen. I'm just going to share the desktop. I find that easier than trying to share just one program's worth of content. Feel free to play around with these and find out options that work best for you. All right, so now on Zoom, I am sharing my screen and it's put me in a little inset box here. So Zoom is sharing. Uh, and I am not recording. No, I am recording. My goodness, what a day. <clears throat> okay, so I'm sharing my screen and recording my content, and I can go over to the program that I want to present from. I can do this either through PowerPoint or uh, Google Slides. I'm kind of okay with either one. Uh, I'm going to do full slideshow, and while it's recording me in Zoom, I should be able to share my screen that's got the content here and uh, flip through these just like I was delivering it in person. Uh, I can minimize myself also and then I'll disappear from the Zoom video. So that's optional to you if you want to have yourself as a little floating head in the corner or you could turn that off uh, while you're while you're presenting before you start presenting or anything like that. All right, so I've done this way. I'm going to go back in and do it uh, in uh, Google Slides, same thing. So I've got my presentation I went to present, and it really looks exactly the same on the presentation front. So whatever program works for you for presenting, and really whatever program works for you for recording yourself presenting would be just fine. All right, let me shut this all down. I'm going to stop my share and then end my meeting on Zoom so I could do a little sign off, uh, end the Zoom meeting, and that will start generating the recording. So now it's pulling up a little recording uh, process bar, progress bar. And when that's done, I'll have the file locally that I can upload to YouTube or uh, put on Canvas or something. So then I'm going to turn off the WebEx recording that I'm doing as well. So I'm going to stop sharing there and end my WebEx meeting and